Hi, George here. And Minecraft 121.11 just came out. And with that, some packs have stopped working and some are still working. Like my custom sword pack, that's still working. But my big pack I used in the back back there to change that into a giant play button, that has stopped working. So if your pack has stopped working with this new update, let me show you the first thing to check. And if this doesn't work, then something in the programming has changed and you need to check out that programming. But in most cases, this will be what you need to do here to go ahead and fix your pack. Okay, now to do this is switch over to the desktop and take a look at the pack for the sword and also the pack for the paintings back there, which is what I used to make my giant YouTube play button. Okay, we're going back to the Minecraft launcher and it's going to installations right here and latest release, there it is, 121.11 and click on the folder icon right there. That opens up the installations folder. Okay, I have two packs I want to show you in here. One is my HDG Custom 9. This is just my basic pack and a lot of my stuff is in here. I don't have this one zipped on purpose. This is just a folder. That way I can come in here and easily fix things without doing any zipping or unzipping. For the rest of my packs, I normally zip those up just to save space. So here's the custom swords. Now this one is working right now and this one is not. Let's take a look at these and we'll see why. So open this one up and we're working with the pack MC meta file right here. I like editing these things in Notepad++. It's a free download and it's a really good code editor. Open this one up, here we go. And you can see here, my minimum format is 68. That's what I had before, that was fine. My max format is 74. I figured that would be big enough to take care of the next update. It was quite a ways away, six numbers away, but it wasn't quite big enough. The problem is that the 121.11 is now pack format 75. So my max format wasn't high enough to contain that. So I'm gonna do that one at 75. Let's make this one at 85. Gives me some room. So little changes on the pack format shouldn't hurt me until it gets up to 85. The reason why I'm not going to 8,500 or something else like that, that's crazy is because I know at some point, Minecraft is gonna be doing some major changes that change the programming, and the pack's gonna stop working anyway. I don't have to rebuild it because of that. But for most cases, this should be just fine. I'll just change my number up here to 11, so I know when I did this one. Save that, and that's now going to work. Okay, let's take a look at the custom swords and how you handle one of these zipped up folders. Right click on this, and I'm going to extract all. Choose extract. Here's the extracted setup right here. Once I have this extracted, I'm going to delete the zip file. We'll be remaking that in just a minute. Open up Custom Swords. Here's the Pack MC Meta. Let's change our view. There we go. Pack MC Meta, open this up. And here we go, back again, made it 68. That was fine. I'll change this one now to the current version just for the heck of it. And notice that the max format is above 75. That's why the Sword Pack is still working because this was a high enough number. Let's just change it to 85. And that should keep it going for a lot of little short updates and it should be okay for a while. All right, this should now be working again. Let's save this, get this out of the way. On this, you don't come out here and zip up the folder. That's not going to work. What you have to do is to come inside, zip the contents up, right click and compress to zip file and give it a name, your custom swords. And I'll just drag that back to the resource packs folder. Come back out of here again. So there's our new zip file. And then just delete this one. And we're all set to go again. And everything should now work just fine for us. Okay, let's go ahead and test it out by playing. There we are and we'll let Minecraft load in. Now, because the packs were not working, they're also deactivated. So come down here to options and resource packs. And they've been fixed, they're no longer in red. I have to go back still and fix these packs, but these are now good. So I'll bring them both over here, right-hand side. Let's choose done. And I should see the whole window here change in just a moment. There we go. That lets me know that my custom pack is working because I use that to change my colors in here. And I get rid of that panorama in the background. All that stuff is done with that one pack. Choose done. If you want to learn how I did all this stuff, I have videos on all these things and you'll find links for those in the description. I guess go inside the game and check that out. Single player, main world. And I want to check two things. I want to check my big silver play button, make sure that that's working again. And of course you can see here that the swords are still working. They're all here. Let's just change my view. There we go. And there's that giant silver play button in the background. So you can see how I made that. It's just a bunch of paintings and I redid the paintings. I'm just changing the paintings in the game. And that gives me that giant silver play button. Now my name is not on here yet. I need to have a lot more subscribers. I'm only at 77,000 so far, but we can get here this summer. If everybody who watches this subscribes, we can make this real fast. Also, if you wanna watch more Minecraft videos on how to actually play the game, not all this customizing stuff, I have a second channel for my play stuff and I'll put the link for that in the description as well. Just go over and take a look at that channel. I think you'll like that one a lot. It's a small channel, but there's a lot of great videos on there and I'll see you next time.